Hello. Got a cup of tea going. It's going to be a good night. Look at that crown. Nice brewed cup of tea. It's been brewing for about five minutes or so. And, um, yeah, comes the people, right? I don't understand why they don't like tea. Well, I think I might actually. It's because everyone puts too much milk in it and doesn't let it brew or anything. That's perfect. Maybe. Oh god, I need two hands for this. Shit. There you go. Much better. I've got the, uh, I needed to squeeze the tea bag out and then uh, drink. Oh, I've got a cup of tea. I've got your questions as well, but I haven't checked. I have eight, including the question of the day. Um, being nine, no, eight. That wasn't including the question of the day. Oh, I haven't checked them yet. Um, so this is going to be as, like, just first reactions, I guess, right? Here we go. Uh, oh, that's the question. I'll do that to last. When will the Q&A video be up? That's one for a Q&A. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty, yeah, oh, no, wait. All right, one of these isn't an on. Um, this Q&A video will be up right now. <laughs> right, it won't be up right now. The one that I'm doing right now will be up. I don't know, whenever it's fucking finished. I don't know. Um, who is the most popular person you know? Um, you know what, I'm probably... I'm probably going to say uh, Ellis, because he has like a shitload of friends on Facebook, and everyone loves his hair, and everyone follows him. On Twitter. So, yeah, I'm gonna say Ellis for that one. Yeah, okay. Um, oh, here's a good one. Favourite song to play with your band? Um, I like this question a lot. Uh, I guess it used to be. Um, I don't know actually. I like, I kind of like all our songs, uh, I like, here's that song you wanted, because it's quite heavy, um, and I managed to get some like weird, kind of slappy stuff in the verse, which isn't on the EP version that I made afterwards, so, shit, um, Keep Your Mouth Shut was fun, I realised how much I actually like that song in the recording of the EP, uh, the same with Parachute, I do like, uh, Everybody Say It's Okay, because that's sort of a bass driven song. Although, excuse that by the way, although you're on the EP you can't really hear the bass so I'm I guess a little bit disappointed with that. But it would be really good if it had more bass in it. Um, and then of course Lost In You which is, I don't know, I think that's just an all round good song. But I think um, favourite song to play with the band hands down, right, is a new song that we've been, well, we've got now, um, and we've played it like, I think we've only played it once live, I think, either way though, oh my god, um, some of you might have heard it already, uh, it's, it's called The Secrets Out, so, uh, yeah, which, I think we, yeah, like I said, I think we've only played it once, like I said, I'm gonna mute that, um, I think we've only played it once, but it, oh my god, it's such a good song. I love it to bits because uh, it's uh, I don't know it's it's got a bit of odd time in it, kind of not really in a way, kind of does. Um, but yeah, it's just sort of like really a punch in the face. Yeah. Okay, that's that one. Rate your band members playing ability from 1 to 10. Okay. Um, 
Right. So. I'm going to start with Ryan. And straight away I'm going to say, and I don't do 1 to 10s, because, I don't know, I, I'm just not very good at racing them. I feel like I might be being too generous or too harsh all the time. So I'm not going to do that. But I'm going to give a general description of, you know, what I like about the band. Or maybe even what I don't like. Um, but I'm going to start with Ryan. Um, he's a good drummer. He's a damn good drummer. He holds shit down very nicely. And my voice is cracking shit though, but I don't care. He holds shit down nicely. And in a recent rehearsal, me and Ryan were just locking in like there's no tomorrow or something. No tomorrow. Um, yeah. We, oh my god, that was so fun. Uh, so yeah, I'd say Ryan's a, a very good drummer. Happy to have him as a drummer. Dylan, he's a very good guitarist. Um, and we've come up with some pretty nifty sort of things, like kind of funky. Oh, Fucking angry bees. Excuse that. We've come up with some uh, pretty nifty little things. Quite funky sometimes. Um, so, yeah, I'd say everyone's really good, basically. I love, uh, like, everyone's... What was I going to say? I, like, I love everyone's style of play, I guess, and yeah, Ryan's got a good, solid ground, you know, and he can hold, he can hold it down, we lock in very well. Dylan's got a very, I mean, he likes a lot of funk rock, I say a lot of funk rock, we all love Red Hot Chili Peppers, so, um, well, I say that, me and Dylan definitely do, so. Um, so yeah, it's that's that comes into play quite a lot. So he's got kind of a funky thing going on sometimes, and then sometimes it's quite it can be quite heavy, you know. So it's it's quite cool. So yeah, Dylan, good guitarist, and oh my god, he can. I'd say he can solo. Um, he can. He's got taste when it comes to solos. I reckon. Um, Ellis, as a guitarist, good guitarist, of course. Um, I can't remember how long he said he's been playing guitar. Uh, I think he says about nine years or something. But um, yeah, good guitarist. Uh, my god, he can write riffs like there's no tomorrow. He can just come up with riffs like that. And they're, each one is just as good as the other. So phenomenal at that. God knows how he does it. And then just comes up with lyrics on the spot as well. And like melodies for all the songs. He, he can write a song in like the time it takes to play that song, for Christ's sake. Like, <laughs> God knows how. Alright, alright. Maybe not that quick, but I don't know, right? Either way, he can fucking do it bloody quick, so brilliant songwriter, brilliant guitarist. Um, got a very punky kind of voice, which usually I don't like, but I think it suits what we play. So, yeah, no, I, I'm, I'm in favour. So, but yeah, all round very good as well. I mean, my hand, hands aching. Oh, yeah, so that that was a almost difficult question. Well, not really, because I'd say we're all quite good. And as a bassist, I'd say I'm okay. You know, I'm quite happy with the way I play bass. I'm not originally a bassist. I'm originally a guitarist, then a drummer, and I think I'm a better drummer than anything else. But, and then... Bass is quite a rhythmic sort of instrument as well, so it's kind of locks in the drums. Um, so yeah, it's. But I'm quite happy with the way I play bass. So I'd say I'm quite good at bass. I'm allowed to say that. Um, and then I'm gonna include Ali in this as well. It says band members, but I'm gonna include Ali. She's a fucking great manager. She books us gigs, and Ellis does a lot of the work as well. I've tried doing some of the work and then I'm like I don't even know what I'm doing so I, I pretty much give up but uh, Ellis and Ali uh, they find gigs and Ali just gets them booked somehow she does some weird mystical shit I think she does something with, with her phone and types in some numbers but like 
yeah, then then we have gigs. So it's really cool. And like festival and stuff like that. She managed to get us festival, which was amazing. So yeah. Very good manager as well, I'd say. Um okay, next question. Do you have any secrets? Not really. Sorry to burst your bubble. Um not really any secrets as such, I guess. But um things that like some people might know and some people might might not, you know. Um but yeah, pretty much anything about me, I don't care who knows and who doesn't, or if people find out certain things, unless it's like my bank details or something like that, and I'd rather not, I'd rather people don't know that, but, <laughs> pretty obvious there, but, um, yeah, I don't know, I guess, uh, not secrets as such, because I don't really care if people know, you know, everything about me, sort of thing, I suppose, uh, no, I don't have secrets, but you may not know everything about me, I suppose, there you go, have fun with that. Yeah. Who would you say is the most talented in your band, and why? Um, see, I don't want to... I, I wouldn't want to put anyone above, any, above anyone else, because like, we're all talented in our own way. Very much so, I'd say. I, I think, personally, I'd say we're a good group of musicians. I'd say we're all good musicians. And we can all play. Is that still recording? Yeah, it is. Thank fuck. We can all play. Uh, and we all enjoy what we do. And we, I think we make some quite good songs. You know? So, I'd say we're all good at what we do. Um, and part of me wants to say... I play lots of instruments, so I'm def no, but you know, but that's that wouldn't by any means put me ahead of anyone else. I think we've I wouldn't say there's a most talented one. I'd just say we're all good at what we do. So I'm yeah, I'm gonna settle for that. Um Make a video where you turn a cowboy into a beef stroganoff. Are you happy? Um yeah, yeah, I'm pretty damn happy. Uh, I we recently just signed off from college, uh, so that's a huge weight off like everything. Um, we've I've recently basically just got a whole new room. We got new windows put into our house, and then Mum went ahead and repainted my room, and then I got a new bed, and then <laughs> everything's been changed about all in the space of like literally a few days. Like, since Saturday, it's... What is it? It's Monday today, isn't it? Uh, yeah, it's Monday today. Since Saturday, it's just been... You know, stuff changing. So, I'd say it's, that's, that's contributed to my happiness. I'd say over, overall I'm quite happy. So, thank you for asking. And, uh, yeah, my PC is kind of up and running again. I'm using a TV as a monitor. Not ideal. But, um, my monitor's still fucked, so I'm going to have to really try and get that sorted out at some point. I really want to get it sorted out. But, um, that won't happen for a long time. So I've got a phone like China, and that's going to cost a shitload. And then, God knows, if I have to send it to China, what the fucking postage and packaging will be. Or just postage, I've got the packaging, but you know. Um, i got some pedals. That made me quite happy, and I won a competition, which made me quite happy, which I'm, I'll probably do separate videos for these, but um, where is the thing I won the competition? Here it is. It is a... I'll go into that in another video. Sorry. Yeah, I just realised it's more of a review type thing, I suppose. But, um, yeah, I guess, thanks for your questions. I actually appreciate it. This time getting questions now instead of like the first time or second time I asked for a Q&A and no one asked me anything. So this this was quite nice. Ah, <sighs> thanks for watching. I'll see you. I don't know. I'm at the next gig if you come to it. Hey, yeah. All right. Okay. Bye.